Hello, it's Bourbonite, I am Chad, and joining me for a special uncorking is Ming Chen from AMC's hit show in its sixth season now, Comic Book Men, which can be seen after The Walking and Talking Dead on Sunday nights. Ming, what are we uh, gonna uncork today? We uh, we got some Elijah Craig Barrel Proof right Ooh, here. Yeah. It's uh, amazing, one that I have not had the pleasure of sampling before. Nice. It's uh, uh, Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey, 139.4 mm -hmm. proof. A little hot. Yes, a little hot. Uh, what do you know well, about we'll Elijah see. Craig? Do you know anything about the history? Where it's, yeah, where it's well, I just, you know, it's, uh, it's Heaven Hill Juice, and a lot of people kind of lose their mind over the brands. Uh, used to have just the regular Elijah Craig had the Red 12 for the 12 year. That's been taken off. It's now a non H stated juice. But people still go crazy for this stuff. Yeah. For the barrel proof. And at almost 140 proof, <laughs> the question well, is is it going to be real hot or is it just going to be like. Drinking, drinking sunshine. Well, we're about to find out. Let's find out. We? Okay, so this is a little different since we're on location here. Yes. I got the mic, so I'm going to set it down. Yes. All right. You, uh, you crack that open. Yeah. Uh, you do the honors. Uh, now we, we are here in Lexington, bourbon country. Mm -hmm. I love bourbon. Out of all the liquors, bourbon is my favorite. Anytime if there's a, if there's a cocktail, and I'm running on the list. I always choose the bourbon cocktail. I prefer. I have a little bit of a sweet tooth. So I like, like uh, sweet ones, like yeah, so, yeah. So you get a little sweet finish usually in bourbon. And gin is good, vodka is good, tequila is good. I think bourbon's just so American. Yeah. And um, and I like anything with variety. So with the variety of bourbons out there is great. Some are some are good, some are not so good, and some are great. So and some ah, are hard to open, but ah yes. That pop. Ah yes. But uh, every time I come to Lexington, I I always try a new a new bourbon. So. So thank you. Uh, so I appreciate this. And when you asked me to be here, if I wanted to sample some bourbon, of course I jumped at the chance. So Absolutely. Cheers. Cheers. And uh, here we go. Oh my. <laughs> okay, it is a little hot. Is it? Yeah. Wow. Well, it's, a, it's a hell of a finish. There. Yeah. Wow. Uh, starts off incredibly smooth. Yeah. And then, um, like a beautiful woman, just kind of like punches you in the face in the end. Yeah. And then you come back wanting more. You so. want more. You're like, wow. Like, well, that was shocking, but uh, do it again. I want it. I want you to do that again. Yeah, so I'm gonna get hit in the face again. Wow. Uh, yeah, yeah totally. Really, uh, it's like an all-over tongue burn. Really warms when it goes down, you know, down your throat. Wow. It's, warms the chest. My uh, my sinuses, my my lungs are clearer right now, my friend. <laughs> wow. I, uh, where did you get this? Ooh. Is this easy to come by? Is it uh, especially in this area? Is it? I would call it. Moderate, moderate to. Wow. Oh wow! The really works. hit you. The yeah. bourbon works. Oh yeah. Moderately rare. Okay. Uh, so I think I may have gotten this bottle actually at the distillery. Oh wow. But well, here in Kentucky we have a lot of, uh, you know, the the big box liquor stores will send out an email. Hey, come this Friday morning. We have this, 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 and this. Right. And we give out. They give out tickets. Yeah. Raffle tickets. Ah, okay. So a lot of times this is one of those that you can purchase. So I've maybe been able to procure like three or four bottles over the past, you know, year and a half or so. Um, but it's not one that I'm always rushing out to get. So I'm kind right. of a moderate Elijah Craig fan. But this is good. Yeah, this is very good. <laughs> yeah, what's your verdict? Is it? A, 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 oh, yeah, it's a hit. Yeah. It's definitely a hit. It's, it's a hit, yeah. Yeah, and since Berman is your business now, since you have a, um, since you do this and yeah. it's a part of your life, how many, how many bottles of bourbon do you currently have in your collection? Oh, I just passed the 300 mark. Wow, okay. That's amazing. Yeah. But our first, our very first episode of It's Bourbon Night was 50 bourbons under $25. So, wow. you know, a lot of those bourbons are, well, you call, you find the ones on the bottom shelf. Sure. You know? But the whole thing for that is let's find a winner. Yeah. Let's fine. find one that's cheap, yep. that tastes amazing. Yep. And I think we accomplished that. This is amazing. Thank you for yeah. uh, oh, absolutely. opening my eyes, my heart, my lungs, <laughs> my sinuses. <laughs> yeah. And everything else. Woo. This is this is good. Elijah Craig, you've done a great job. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Wow, it's good, and it doesn't drink like 140. It drinks like uh, 120. Yeah, so, 120. 120. But it hits you like a 140. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, this is this is great stuff. Yeah, I like it. Thank I you dig. so much. My pleasure, and and thank you for coming on. Thank you for loving bourbon and uh, doing what you do on Comic Book Men. Again, check them out Sunday nights after Walking and Talking Dan. It's Comic Book Men. Ming Chen and the other guys. Um, this show's going to go on forever, I think. As long as there's a, a Walking Dead, I think there's going to be a man, comic book, I hope man. so. I need, I need money to buy more bourbon, is what I need. <laughs> Don't we all. Yeah. All right, thanks so much, Ming. Thank and you. we'll see you next time. Drink more bourbon. <laughs>